hello friends good evening and welcome to your new video my name is Holland um, yesterday we started a project uh, concerning uh, um, Revit and um, I took us east and today is uh, the time to continue yesterday we did the takeoff and um, I finished the takeoff like you can see here this is the takeoff I finished. You can see. So today um, our plan is to um, start to use our um, our dimension, the dimension we take yesterday. So we will start to use it and um, to see how we will promote our drawing and the dimension we took yesterday. So um, I will not uh, speak long for for the presentation. So uh, I will just start. Okay, now this is the takeoff I finish. The next thing to do is to create um, a revision, a revision inside to uh, I to cost is. You see the program is open. So now we create a new revision. So this is the revision we want to create. We will give the name okay we'll say this is revision we call it just revision um revision a okay when we finish if we have any command we want to do we can insert the the, um, the comment here if you want to comment anything we can insert it here but if uh, it is all what we have to give here we can just click on insert and uh, our, um, our revision will be created so what are we doing now the time is to um, promote the drawings so we create a new revision so now is the time for us to create uh, to make to make the promotion of the drawings uh, we took so this is this uh, command here that is what we will use so we will just click on it and wait a little bit and will these uh, windows will op be open and we click on it and just wait a little bit and we will create a new um, project Project 12, we can conserve the name. So um, we can just click on open. So we just wait a little bit. And we can just, we can keep this name or um, just change it. But we will keep this name and that is not problem. So uh, we keep Lot update so uh, when we finish it now we can see that uh, we have um, a lot of uh, mistake this is a mistake in our uh, drawings in our takeoff so what you have to do is to um, go on this mistake and we have to correct it so anytime we have uh, we see this um, danger warning, it means okay we have a mistake inside our uh, dimension. So we will open it. That means okay this is what we have, and um, what is the mistake? Okay, if we if it uh, the, the if we see the mistake is not uh, is correct, we can just click here and confirm and confirm. So the uh, dimension will be take like uh, we have here. So let us check again. This is everything is uh, zero. I don't know why, but it's like it didn't work.
everything we did here is zero why is that so So, 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 what happened? What happened? Yes. Okay. Confine. Yes. So now we'll just correct it. We'll just check it again. Uh, we'll just check it again and see if everything is okay. So that is the way we will correct us all, all this mistake. You see now it's zero zero. We will check it again. We check all the measure, uh, the dimension we took, and we will confirm. So like we click here, and if we see it is correct, like you see here, we will just click here. Okay. We have, you see here we have three. Here again, how many shower do we have? We just have one. We we'll click on okay. So far. We have three, we click on OK. Table, how many do we have? Just one, so we click on OK. And continue to do the same, OK. So I will just continue, OK. How many, three, six, why not? One, OK. OK. So we continue here, this was the first, and we come back here, living room, the area, we check if it is uh, the, uh, what we want, we will just click on OK, we check it here, we check the next one, it's OK, next, OK, I think uh, this step is just to check if the, the the dimension we took is uh, is okay before we um, before we continue, so this is door. How many doors we have? We just have one big. We will click OK. The next one, smaller doors. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight. We click OK. We have it. Okay, the next uh, dimension is windows. How many windows we have? We click on it. On and we count. It's okay. Here, small windows. Okay, four. Here, the dimension did. Uh, do we correct that? No, this not uh, this. This dimension is not our dimension, so we will continue here. This is the slab foundation, so we will check it, and if it, everything is okay, we will just confirm here. We have it here, and continue internal, intern, internal, and we click OK. OK. Let me check it. There is other possibility to um, confine everything by clicking this command. Let me try it. Yes. Just continue to confirm here like you see. So we check and we check if everything is okay the way we want and we will confine. Is. Mm, why not? What is the problem here? Confine. Okay, let us try the next one. Have it. And it's okay. This one. Wall number six. What is the problem? Click didn't work. Can we correct something? So there is the possibility to correct things here. So if there is something is wrong, 
so we can correct it but uh, the problem is here i don't see anything wrong so i don't know why the program is refusing to um to confine to take the dimension so let me try again no Okay, let me take it again. I think I have the possibility to take it again, to correct it. So, because the because it's not working, so I will take it again. Take the dimension again. Yeah. Yeah, and we can close it. Okay, now uh, now we have and uh, we can confine. Okay, we still have this uh, warning. I don't know why, but I think uh, we can continue. Okay, if you finish, if we finish and everything, let us check it here. Yeah? No. Still have this part, so we will confine it again. Confine, yes, yes, one we will confine, yes, confine, yes, one confine, and the last one we will confine. Okay, now we have our dimension. We have a dimension we have some mistake but i don't i don't i don't really know why we still have this um warning so i will check it so when we finish this um this step this step is finished so now it's time to um to continue to continue the work okay okay when we finish we can go back on the revision revision everything is okay and now it's time to um to check again we can also check our correction the correction we did here so this list is giving us uh the change we make this is all the ch all what we took and we have the thing that we change this is only the change that uh, the uh, the dimension that was not changed and this is the change dimension so when we finish it we can close it when we finish we can close it and now it's time to um check the workbook okay we go inside we can also compare i think one provision okay let us check we don't have to so it's to, it's all what we have so we go back here in our uh, dimension provision in our revision So now we have this and it's time to create OK. 
king. So it's time for us to create a workbook. So we create a workbook so that we will start to use the and set the name um, work workbook workbook. Our book uh, let us call A and we can click on insert okay this is what we have this is our workbook so now we can start um, to bring our dimension the dimension we took the dimension we have here we can start to bring it inside the workbook but before we do, we, we bring our dimension inside the workbook. I will go through all this uh, command, so we will see uh, why we need it and where we need it. So for today, I will stop the the video. I hope you you like it, and um, I hope to see you next time. Command if you have any question concerning what I did. You can write inside. Uh, you can write the comment. Uh, you can comment or just um, contact me, and uh, I'm will be ready, or I will be ready to share uh, what I know. Have a nice evening, and see you next time. Ciao.